When do you think we might see them in the UK? In the UK, I believe uh, 2010. Okay, excellent. And can you tell me a little bit about the technology, the range, the battery type? It's, kind of thing. it's a lithium-ion battery and uh, the range for those batteries will be uh, close to 200 kilometers. Really? Yeah. Wow. Fast charge? Uh, you could, but not, uh, not uh, initially. We will have a normal charge uh, to start up with and see whether or not it's necessary to, to fast charge them. And what is normal charge for it? Uh, you know, uh, I would say like eight hours from zero to 100. Eight hour charge, 200, 200 kilometer range on those batteries. Yes. How long do you think they'll last? Well, we are talking about 100 deep cycles, so uh, that will uh, normally, if you do the arithmetic, it would be like 200,000 kilometers. Where are the components being put together? The dry train is put together in Canada okay. by TM4. Okay. So they got the, uh, the dry train and the uh, steering system for, for the dry train. Okay. And the batteries, where are they mounted? The batteries are mounted in Norway and produced by Milieu Innovation, the okay. uh, sister company to Milieu Bill. Yeah, excellent. And where are they mounted in the vehicle? Are they underneath? It's, it's mounted underneath in the back. So do you have space in the boot in the back? I'm just going to have a quick look with you. I don't think you will be able to get, it, get in there. The car is locked. Oh, but okay. All right, no worries. You see, the batteries are placed here. Yeah, excellent. Okay, let's see. So lithium-ion battery packs all at the back. And uh, four seat, five seater. Four yeah. seats. Four seats. Okay. Due, to, due to the weights, we have to reduce uh, from five to four seats. Okay. And can we, can we not go inside no. at all? It's not. It's all closed. Okay. What it looks like is a, a, a good standard family car, though. It's a good size. Is it? Is it rated for NCAP crash protection safety? It will be, I think. Yeah. Will be. Yeah. Okay. So it has a safety cell around it and everything else. It's not going to be classed as a quadricycle, like. In, in the UK, most EVs are, are classed like quadricycles. Yeah, no, 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 no. This is a standard standard vehicle. Excellent. And do we know how much it's going to cost? We know at least in Norway it will cost like 250,000 NOx. Okay. Which uh, is equivalent to 25,000 pounds. But then again, cars in Norway are very expensive to, to begin with. So uh, we think it's a very competitive, compatible car uh, in the Norwegian market.